Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Hope. Today's video, I'm gonna be doing a roundup of some of my favorite pieces from YesStyle. And if you guys aren't familiar with them, they're basically like an Asian Amazon. There's tons of different sellers on there, so it's really hit or miss. You guys can use a coupon code and a rewards code, so you can stack both of them. They'll give you an extra discount, and I'll link everything in the description box as well. And before getting into the video, I wanna talk about today's video sponsor, which is Ana Luisa. So I got some new items. As you guys know, I am an ambassador. So I've shown a lot of different products that I've tried from them and I got some new items and I think it's gonna be perfect for Valentine's Day. They have a huge selection of products. So if you wanna buy something for yourself or any loved ones, I feel like they have some really good options. Everything comes in little pouches like this. So it makes it even cuter if you do give it as a gift. So the first item I picked up is a pair of chunky earrings. These are a gold like smaller hoop and the earrings that I'm wearing right now are my current everyday earrings I've been wearing these I think for over a month straight it's just the silver Ana Luisa hoops I don't know the exact name but I'll put it on the screen currently I've been in the silver mood but I do like to mix like both gold and silver just depending on the day and then the next item that I picked up is another pair of earrings this one is called the Hannah Lee gold earrings I actually have this in the silver version and I like the way it looks stack so i wanted to pick it up in gold i got some gold hoops from Ana luisa last time so i thought stacking it with these would be cute just to have something that dangles or like some sort of charm and then the next item is another pair of earrings so these are the ashley double in gold this is kind of like a two-in-one earring because if you take off the bottom part it actually is just a simple hoop but you have the option to make it a one or two layer. The last item I have is the Orin ring a size six in gold. This ring is super dainty. I feel like it's a perfect ring to stack with a bunch of other ones. So those are the pieces that I picked up from Ana Luisa. If you guys like any of these items or they also have a ton of different options on the website, you guys can use the code HOPEC20 for 20% off. And thank you to Ana Luisa for sponsoring today's video. We're gonna do bottoms first. And the first one I have listed is the white carpenter style jeans. This has like contrast stitching on the side. It kind of looks like something that Brandy Melville would sell. And it does have an adjustable waistband in the inside. And I did get a size small for reference. It's a very good length if you're also petite. Most of these Yes Style items, I will say if you're on the taller side, these might not be the best option for you because a lot of the bottoms are naturally built to be shorter. Next one is pretty similar. It's like a carpenter style denim with a little loop on the side. This one is a bit more of a baggy fit than the white ones and it does run a little bit longer i did get a size small for reference it's very comfortable and lightweight type of denim next one is a cargo style pant i have this in green black and brown so this actually has like the pockets on the side is definitely a very baggy fit the reviews seem pretty good everyone says it runs oversized which i would definitely agree kind of like the denim it's a bit of a more thinner material so you can definitely wear this in the summer it's really comfortable and the pockets are real and then i have these black draw string athletic style pants so this is like a super comfortable kind of like just like casual loungewear type of pant i love the reflective stripe going down the leg bottom around the ankle has the option to cinch if you do want to do that and there is an elastic waistband and this is another example of something that is a really good length if you're on the petite side and you've been looking for a more athletic style pant but can't seem to find one that is a shorter inseam i would say this is a good option i also like these trousers from yes style so it's kind of like a dress pant i would say it's a bit on the thinner side which makes it really comfortable and lightweight it's a really good like casual trouser and the reviews are really good as well i have this in three different colors i have it in gray tan as well as black you can definitely tell it's not like the highest quality it's not going to be be something like Aritzia or Abercrombie but I feel like it's good for the price and then the next item is this midi skirt it's a printed brown tone or neutral tone midi skirt it has two layers which is really nice so the top layer is mesh but surprisingly really good quality for what it is I've tried a lot of midi skirts from Princess Polly and I love Princess Polly but I would say it's definitely pricier and in comparison I would say the skirt feels pretty much exactly the same quality as the Princess Polly one and I did get a size small very good length so if you have a 
hard time finding midi skirts for petite height or petite frame, this is a good option. And then a couple mini skirts that I really like from YesStyle. So the first one is probably one of my most worn. It's just a basic black mini skirt. So it has the shorts built into it. It's super comfortable, kind of feels like leggings. And I like that it's not too long. Another skirt, this one is a cargo style skirt. I have this in white as well as black. And this one does run pretty short as well, which I like. And it does have shorts underneath anyway, so it doesn't really matter. So the first one I've talked about a lot on my channel because it's one of my favorites in my closet. It's the faux leather jacket from YesStyle. So it's not a jacket. I would say it's more like a shirt jacket, a bit of a thinner material. So this is perfect for fall and springtime. And then the next jacket, I was a little hesitant to include this only because I like the way it looks, but it is definitely not the best quality. And it's actually a men's jacket. It's reversible. It's just like a really lightweight thin jacket. It won't keep you warm. So it's one of those pieces that is good for transition weather. And then for accessories, one of my favorite items from YesStyle in general are these sheer tights. I have so many of these. I buy them in bulk because as you guys know, sheer tights, they rip all the time. So it's good to have backups. So I specifically get the coarse fun yarn in coffee as well as in black. The other accessory that is really good from YesStyle is this checkered scarf. It kind of looks like this scarf that I have from Urban as well as Lulu's, but this one is definitely way more affordable. The first knit I have is a bolero. I have this in the whitish cream color as well as the black. It feels exactly like something you'd find at Princess Polly. So the next one is this printed sweater. It kind of looks like black and tan. It's actually a navy color instead of black. This is one of my favorite items from YesStyle. I think it's really good. I actually shared this with my mom. I think it's like really good quality. You would never believe it's from YesStyle. This next sweater, I'm sure you guys have seen a ton on my channel. I wear it quite a bit. I got a size medium and it's just like the perfect oversized striped sweater. So this next item, I personally I don't really wear anymore because I don't really like the color. I don't really wear purple and like bright colors that much. I think it's a good item if you do like that style because it is good quality. It's this purple crop sweater. It has a bunch of hearts all over it. It's super soft and comfortable and it definitely feels well made. This next item is a navy crew neck. I got the one without the pocket. It's the navy blue color. This definitely looks like something you'd find at Brandy Melville. And this is really well made for Yes Style. It probably is very similar to the Brandy Melville ones. It's either a size small or one size. I'll put it in the description. The last knit I have is this striped multicolored cardigan and this looks exactly like the photos so that's always good it's one size only the reviews are pretty good i would say i don't really wear it that often because it's like super colorful but i was just trying to test out some different items for you guys to review the first one is this blue plaid dress. I love this dress. Quality wise, it feels pretty good. It's not see-through. I'm pretty sure it was double lined and it's a really comfortable dress as well. You could definitely wear this in the summertime because it's super lightweight. Similar to that, another plaid dress. This one is a black one. It has longer sleeves. So it's like the short sleeve instead of the tank top. And this one is another really comfy lightweight dress. I would say both dresses don't have that much stretch. So keep that in mind. The last dress is this basic knit long sleeve dress. And surprisingly, the quality of this was really nice it's like pretty thick not gonna be see-through and i got the lighter color version and it's not see-through at all so moving on to tops the first one is this one shoulder top i have it in blue as well as in orange and this is like a dupe of this lioness top and i actually tried the dress version of the lioness one the quality was exactly the same as the yes style one it's a stretching material by the way and it's definitely one of the better made tops on yes style and then the last yes style top is just this lace white button up collared style top i would say this quality is like okay it's not the best but i like the way it looks personally i feel like the quality is decent enough that I still wear it and I still like it. I think it's on par with the price. So if you guys are still watching, I'm assuming you're interested in watching the little haul that I have of a recent Yes Style purchase. I don't have any clothing. They're all accessories. Sorry for all the crinkling sound because everything's still in its packaging. But the first item are the sheer tights that I was talking about in the accessory section of this video. So I pretty much just stocked up because I was running low on the sheer nude tights. I got four of the black ones and three of the coffee colored. And as you guys can see, I just like to pick up multiple because the shipping takes a while. So just in case one of them rips, it's good to have it in stock. And then this other tight, I actually wore this already, so I already took it out. But it's a black sheer tight that has these ribbons going down the leg. I'm just going to put on my arm so you guys can see how it looks. It has like these holes going down the leg. Then this next item, I think it's just like a little 
headband. I've seen people when they're getting ready wear this, so it's like little bunny ears. And then I also got two different earmuffs and I tried some from Amazon, but the head part, I don't know what you'd call it, is too big. So it runs like too low instead of sitting up high on my head. I think it's like the band is too long. So I wanted to see if the Yes Style ones fit better. So this is how it looks. It is definitely very big. It will cover your entire like it's a little bit long still, just like the Amazon one. Like, it would be nicer if it sat up. So I honestly think it might be the exact same one as the Amazon one. So I'm not really sure if this will work. This is the white one. So this is the white one. And yeah, it kind of looks exactly like the Amazon one. So it might be, it is really cute, but it just kind of runs really long. Like it sits so low, unless it's supposed to look like that, I don't know. And then this next item I think is a fluffy bucket hat. So this actually has like a little string in the inside, which I was not expecting. So you can kind of like tighten it if you have a smaller head. And let's see how, I don't want to mess up my hair. I don't ever know if I look weird in hats because I kind of have a weird head shape. And then last but not least, I just got some eyelashes. I've really been wanting to try manga or anime style lashes. And I tried one from Amazon, but it was way too dramatic or like too big for, I would say like smaller eyes. I wanted to see if YesStyle would have better options that are more suited for like Asian eyes. So I did get three different options to try out. And honestly, I can't tell you if this will work until I test out each pair. If I like them, I'll let you guys know. But those are all the pieces that I got from YesStyle and all of the items that I talked about earlier will be linked in the description box. Thank you again to Anna Luisa for sponsoring today's video. Don't forget you guys can use the code HOPESY20 for 20% off.